this is this is just the beginning. We're just starting to um, you know experimenting with uh, the wallet, simple experiences, but we have bigger plans for the future, and we want to facilitate even more like the onboarding experience and the crypto experience in general. And our plans is to let users use everyday language for everything, right? How can you do that? We learned a, uh, a new thing that, that's quite recent called function calling um, on LLMs. So ChatGPT, for example, uh, supports this. And essentially, you can convert natural language into API calls or database queries, or even extract structured data from, uh, from text. Uh, so we went on and built two plugins, one called Action and the other Search. So Action allows you to transform a prompt into a database query, submit that, and get the result as you can see here. So on the right, that would be like the normal developer way. And then on the left, it's pretty much the same result, but you're just prompting with natural language. And then uh, Mint this action allows you to do the same thing, but for transactions on chain. So no need to code. Just say, I, I want to send this token to this account, and it will do it for you. Since uh, ChatGPT and OpenAI have like very strict policies, we cannot really um, do on-chain mainnet transactions, so we had to build uh, a solution. And thanks for Alex Kidanov to like shout out uh, Mintbase AI uh, yesterday. It's free um, for now. <laughs> uh, Mintbase AI um, lets you use ChatGPT4 uh, Turbo uh, start since this week. And I want to show you a couple of prompts. Um, so let's just uh, scroll through some of the, the, the potential prompts you can use. You can ask, what's my account? And you'll have the, your address. You'll see which network you're connected to, and you'll see the balance. Uh, you can also ask, what tokens do I own in my collection? And well, it's summarized 24 tokens on mainnet. And now I want to see some more details, right? So if you, wanna, if you ask, show me details, it, it still keeps the context of the previous prompts, and will show you like details, details uh, about each token on your collection. You can also ask it to generate images. This is not on-chain, but every image generated is stored on Arweave. So it's sort of on-chain. I asked it to like, generate an image of Rick and Morty. I'm not sure about the copyright here, but that's fine. And then I can ask, I want to mint this token on my contract. And it will combine two function calls, one submit query to see if I have any contract to mint on, and then generate a transaction uh, to which I can mint. And that's it. So how can this be applied to the onboarding experience? Well, users can just go through this and learn how to use uh, safely in a playground environment. But in the future, we want to like educate it even more. right? So we want to use. Um, for example, this, right? So you want to sign a transaction. This is one of the biggest problems to users, right? That they sign transactions sometimes that they don't really know anything about. And uh, that might be an issue. So yeah, we want to let users just ask what are they're signing, signing and get uh, a description of uh, the transaction. So this is it.